हॅलो एव्हरी वन दिस इज अंकिता बेर्डे वन्स अगेन वेलकम यू ऑल ऑन माय यूट्यूब चॅनल सो आफ्टर स्टडिंग द टू पार्ट्स ऑफ द एम सी क्यूज देन नेक्स्ट वी विल मूव टुवर्ड्स द लॉंग आन्सर टाईप ऑफ द क्वेश्चन द एम सी क्यू पार्ट वी विल कंटिन्यू द लॅटर देन नाव सी दीज आर द क्वेश्चन्स फॉर द फायू मार्क्स इन द लॉंग आन्सर टाईप इच क्वेश्चन इज फॉर द फायू मार्क्स देन सी दीज आर द सम रिपीटेड क्वेश्चन्स आर देअर दॅट वी कॅन गो थ्रू द इट फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज द डिफाईन फार्माकोपिया अँड नेम द various editions of the ip and along with the publication year and there are the publications and here that ask the silent features of the fifth edition of ip so uh, any edition whether it's eighth edition fifth fourth is there uh, also first edition is also there so any type of any edition is asked uh, in the examination so now see the definition of the pharmacopeia so it is that uh, derived from the greek word pharmakon pharmakon it is nothing but the drug and the poia it means to make that is the making of the drug and uh, this pharmacopia it is the official book it is the legal 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 from what point of view that is uh, it is under the ministry of the india if you see the pharmacopia in your library then uh, on that first uh, you can see cover page Mm, there is a along with the legal stamps are there raja mudra is there so that's why it's a re- legal book which is uh, appointed by the government of the each country for us it is that is under the united states then for the india ip it is under the india so this is the simple definition of the pharmacopeia that is defined pharmacopeia then uh, in the one liner questions also this definition it is a so that is it is derived from the greek word that is pharmakon pharmakon means the drug and here poia poia is means to make and it is a legal and it is official book which is issues issues by recognized authorities and it is usually appointed by the government of each country then now see the editions of ip and the publication year so we had already discussed that is uh, first edition 1955 then second 66 third no uh, you have to just remember 55 66 then 85 96 fifth edition it is in year 2007 uh, then sixth edition it is in 2010 7th edition 2014 and 8th edition is in 2018 so uh, last time that mcq were asked that is 8th edition of the ip is published in which year so it is in 2018 then now see the uh, silent features of the 5th edition so uh, now see silent features of this 5th edition that is it is presented in the three volumes three volumes are there in that you have to write down what contents in each volume म्हणजे प्रत्येक वॉल्युममध्ये काय काय आहे दॅट यू हॅव टू मेन्शन हियर सायलंट फीचर्स ऑफ फिफ्थ एडिशन इज आस्क सो द इंडियन फार्माकोपिया दॅट इज फिफ्थ एडिशन इन इट इज टू थाउजंड सेवन सो इट इज इन थ्री पार्ट्स इन दॅट वॉल्युम वन वॉल्युम वन विच कंटेन्स द जनरल नोट्स प्रिफेस द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ द आय पी सी introduction and general chapters it is in volume 1 then volume 2 which is deals with the general monographs on drug substances dosage forms and pharmaceutical aids it is in volume 2 and volume 3 of this same same edition fifth edition which contains the monographs on the drug substances and the dosage form okay dosage forms pharmaceutical aids vaccines and immunosera for the human use that is herbs and herbal products blood and blood related products biotechnology products and veterinary products that is in that so about the three uh, means 2007 मध्ये काय आहे टोटल टोटल तीन वॉल्यूम आहेत त्याच्यामध्ये वॉल्यूम वनमध्ये काय आहे नोट्स 
प्रिफेस स्ट्रक्चर इंट्रोडक्शन जनरल चैप्टर देन वॉल्यूम टू मधे का है दैट यू हैव टू मेन्शन मोनोग्राफ्स ऑन दी ड्रग्स सब्सटन्सेस डोसेज फॉर्म फार्मास्यूटिकल एड्स देन वॉल्यूम थ्री मोनोग्राफ्स ऑन दी ड्रग्स सब्सटन्स देन डोसेज फॉर्म फार्मास्यूटिकल एड्स वैक्सीन्स इम्युनोसेरा फॉर ह्यूमन यूज हर्ब्स एंड हर्बल प्रोडक्ट्स ब्लड एंड ब्लड रिलेटेड प्रोडक्ट बायोटेक्नोलॉजी प्रोडक्ट वेटरनरी प्रोडक्ट्स देन नाउ सी जनरल केमिकल टेस्ट फॉर आइडेंटिफिकेशन हैव ऑलमोस्ट क्लैमिनेटेड एंड मोर स्पेसिफिक इन्फ्रा रेड आई दैट इज आई आर एंड यू वी अल्ट्रा वायोलेट स्पेक्ट्रो फोटोमेट्रिक टेस्ट दैट हैव बीन गिवन फर्स्ट इज पैल तीन वॉल्यूम वॉल्यूम वन वॉल्यूम टू एंड वॉल्यूम थ्री देन जनरल केमिकल टेस्ट सो स्पेसिफिक थिंग्स यू हैव टू मेन्शन ओनली देन थर्ड टेस्ट फॉर दी पायरोजन्स which involves the animal use and the test for bacterial endotoxin of first volume total three volume in that volume 1 volume 2 and volume 3 <coughs> in that that you have to mention second is about the general chemical test then third is for the test for pyrogens which is involve the use of animals that is eliminated and a test for bacterial endotoxins that have been introduced then the test for abnormal toxicity uh, is uh, now confined to certain vaccines then the use of chromatographic methods have been extended has been extended in assays to large number of pharmaceutical products use of chromatographic methods labeling and storage are of uh, are future at the end of a monograph labeling and storage conditions are mentioned then uh, the general monographs for dosage forms of active pharmaceutical ingredients they are grouped together at the beginning of volume 2 which is followed by the monographs for pharma active pharmaceutical in ingredients then pharmaceutical aids then individual dosage forms all are in they are all in the alphabetical order then monographs for other articles of the special nature such as the vaccines immunosera for human use herbs and herbal products same which is in volume 3 then limit of the bacterial contamination analytical methods so as uh, this simple things or in the short you can mention about the uh, that is uh, when feature silent features of any addition of the ip is asked that you have to write down then next uh, these were uh, questions which is generally uh, asked in the previous year examination that is asked that is explain various job opportunities in the pharmacy so firstly you have to keep in mind that is as a pharmacist so pharmacy diploma degree holders they are uh, can work in the hospitals they are uh, in that uh, they can works as a hospital pharmacist then community pharmacy consultants pharmacists or industrial pharmacists that's various roles of the pharmacist you can write down as a pharmacist then in the central and state governments so central and state government uh, health protection badge department of the health and well uh, welfare so in that department of the agriculture and so this you can the write down you can ma make this screenshot of this central and state government then in pharmaceutical industry so industries where the pharmacists is employed which is include the production manufacturing research and development quality control quality assurance pharmaco vigilance regulatory affairs business operation sales and administration it is in pharmaceutical industry then pharmaceutical sales so uh, as a pharmacist being a pharmacist or the registered pharmacist uh, can sell the bulk drugs as a bulk drug distributor or the supplier and pharmaceutical uh, that is products as a distributor and the wholesaler so in case of pharmaceutical sales then pharmaceutical marketing so uh, in the pharmaceutical marketing uh, that is uh, you can various industries are there so uh, they want to market their products so to marketing their products and services they are offering the excellent opportunities for the uh, pharmacy students who are having the good knowledge about the drug molecules their therapeutic uh, effect 
देयर स्टेबिलिटी ड्रग एक्सीपियंट ड्रग ड्रग इंटरेक्शन एंड दीज पोजिशन्स विच आर इन्क्लूड दी ग्लोबल मैनेजर ऐट दी हायर लेवल टू द मेडिकल ऐट दी लोअर लेवल और बींग अ फ्रेशर इट इज कंसिडर्ड एज अ मेडिकल रिप्रेजेंटेटिव ऐट द लोअर लेवल एंड द ग्लोबल मैनेजर एज अ ऐट दी हायर लेवल देन इन दी एकेडमिक्स ऑल्सो फार्मासिस्ट डिग्री होल्डर्स दे आर एम्प्लॉयड इन द यूनिवर्सिटीज एंड कॉलेजेस ऑफ द फार्मस इन इंडिया विच इज इन्वॉल्व इन द टीचिंग रिसर्च पब्लिक सर्विस एंड द पेशंट केयर देन डी फॉर्म कैंडिडेट्स आर देअर दे आर एम्प्लॉयड एज लैबोरेटरी असिस्टंट इन द एकेडमिक इंस्टिट्यूशन्स देन इन केस ऑफ हायर एजुकेशन there are the many opportunities for the डी farm holder in the higher education uh, so pharmacy student after the डी farm so he can uh, apply for the uh, for graduation and the post graduation एम farm एम एस आणि पी एच डी अँड द व्हेरियस सर्टिफिकेट कोर्सेस विच आर ऑफर्ड बाय दी गव्हर्नमेंट पब्लिक अँड दी प्रायव्हेट इन्स्टिट्यूट्स फार्मसी स्टुडंट कॅन जॉईन Uh, also the foreign language courses are available and immigrate to other countries easily there are the many students are there who are pass out from the india and uh, they are the serving good in the other countries in the foreign countries pharmaceutical journalism is there is uh, another field growing field for the opportunity of the pharmacist and uh, it is having the much great potential then in the consultancy services also so he can as a consultant uh, pharmacist for the local state national and international private and government organization which includes the fields such as regulatory affairs manufacturing analytical services documentation approvals research and marketing policies are there then in clinical research organization that is pharmacist are employed at clinical research associate regulatory affairs associate clinical data manager clinical development and the project manager then organizational management which is pharmacist at the local and state association and on the boards of the pharmacy then there are the many opportunities abroad also for the higher educations as we have seen and the medical transcription so he can work with the physician as medical transcript transcriptor to maintain the patient treatment history and the drug to which the patients are allergic means specific drugs are there so that patient is having the allergy for the particular drug so the drug in which the patient are allergic so pharmacist can work with the physician as well as the medical transcriptor to maintain that patient treatment history so as a medical transcription Oh, these are the different uh, fields are there for the uh, pharmacist uh, so these are the two broad questions uh, which we are seen next uh, emulsions next we will continue in the next video okay so if you like this video then please press the like button and if you didn't subscribe the channel then please subscribe first and press the bell icon to get the latest updates of the upcoming videos thank you happy learning.